welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm really excited about today's video. Um, today I'm going to be going through my entire kitchen slash uh, fridge slash pantry slash cabinet slash drawers and throwing away slash donating everything to try to become more minimal. I'm allowed to say that word. Um, I know that minimalistic lifestyle looks completely different for so many people. Um, I'm not the kind of person that it's going to look like five things in their house. Like I can't do that, but I do want to make myself more free when it comes to items. Like I don't want to be physically, emotionally attached to something. Um, unless it's, everything is just stuff okay so my goal really is to just clean out everything in my kitchen and donate it slash trash it so um hello everyone if you're new here I'm, i am a wife of almost five years i have a daughter who is two and a half will be three in november a son who is seven months old and i make lifestyle videos and today's video is decluttering and today is actually going to be the first video of a brand new series, <laughs> brand new series on my channel. It's going to be our decluttering series. This week I'm going to be doing a video every day this week. Can I do it? Comment down below if you think I can do it. Um, but basically every day this week I'm going to be cleaning out one room in my house. Today's room is the kitchen. Um, I'm really just gonna be going through everything and stripping it out, I need to clean out and wipe down my fridge. I need to clean out and wipe down my pantry and like foods that I've just had in there forever that are not expired, of course, um, that I know my family's not going to eat. Then I'm going to be like donating it because we have a place in town that you can donate food and I'm going to be donating like anything I get rid of that's not trash, I'm going to be trying to donate. We have a bunch of thrift stores and everything in town. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Um, make sure that you are subscribed because, and the notification bell is on because like I said, every day this week, I will be posting a video. That is my goal. Um, I will be cleaning, organizing during the day. And then that video will be uploaded that night. So today's Monday to Monday night will be the video. So that is my goal. That's what we're doing. I really, really hope you guys enjoy it. I went over on Instagram and chatted with you guys and you guys really responded. So that was really awesome. Um, and everybody is super excited about this as am I, because me filming this is inspiring me to actually do the work. So I don't know if Jackson's awake. I need to check on that. Hang on. done and if you can't tell in the time lapse I got interrupted about 17 times <laughs> Jackson fell over I went to the car to get the sling but then I was like let me see if the high chair will work for him and so far he's happy but I got the fridge done and uh, I had two entire shelves two entire shelves of sauces that went bad last month last month in July it's August. I had a couple from June, but it was mainly like June and July. And Elena keeps coming back and seeing snacks and wanting snacks. So that is that. I'll show you guys the end result later, but now I'm gonna tackle the freezer. Let's do it. very difficult <laughs> but that's okay <sighs> okay so I got the fridge the fridge and the freezer done 
Um, now I'm gonna continue with the pantry since oh. I'm like in the mindset of like food and all that stuff. Um, I'm gonna work on the pantry. <laughs> I don't know if he feels good or not. He sounds a little congested. So, you know, come to think of it, I'm not feeling very good either, but we're just not gonna talk about it because if mom starts to not feel good, then that's not good. So, we're just gonna refill our coffee. I refilled it, no, I didn't refill it. I had a little leftover from my blender. Blender cup, just poured it all over me and poured it in there. So, fridge is done, freezer's done. Let's move on to the pantry. gonna be <laughs> um taking a short break to see if Jackson's ready to take his nap or not yeah he's been chilling in this little chair on the table while I'm watching him very closely um and I gotta clean up the mess that I've got going on here like I've got some boxes I'm gonna take out my trash bags um I've got three trash bags of either expired food um boxes that I just like converted things back in like I had, let me think, I had two syrups that, I had two syrups and so I just combined them because why not? Um, and then I've got like sugars that I combined and just different things and then like my cereal boxes wouldn't fit up here. Um, so I just put the bags up there for now because I'm, I'm making a list of things like I've got fridge containers I wanna buy and then cereal containers and then it's gonna be my running list of things that I want to use for organization. Now. That is a huge declutter so far. I've got three trash bags, like I said. Um, and then I found a couple things down here that I'm going to kind of um, Mama, not play around with. It's, huh? What? This? Okay. Um, I need to get more pouches because my kids love pouches. Um, anyways, that was <laughs> random. So um, I'm going to take a short break. And I will then continue with the kitchen. I'm pretty much halfway, Elena, please don't move my tripod. I'm pretty much halfway done already. The fridge and the pantry was a big, big, big chunk. Um, and I've, Elena, please. Please don't kick my tripod. Don't. Um, so whenever I get done with his nap, I'm going to put him down, wash him up. Yes, I'm going to wash you up, huh? Um, then I'm going to come in the kitchen. So a few weeks ago, I decluttered my kitchen already with a bunch of pots and pans and different things like that. Dishes I didn't need. I already donated that. So it's probably just going to be like a updated. So hopefully that's not going to take me too long. Um, but I think we're doing pretty good. So. Like I said, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got Jackson down for his nap. I don't know how long he's gonna sleep. I don't think he's feeling too good. We went out of town this weekend, so who knows if he caught something. Really praying that he didn't, but we'll see. It also could just be teething. He is, he got, he's breaking all the top teeth right now. So this is what my current state looks like. Okay, so we got the pantry done. We've got all this I need to clean up. So I need to like stop and regroup before I start my next process like the project so I got the first half of my kitchen done and I now I need to do the kitchen the actual kitchen like cabinets and stuff um, but first I need to clean all of this up um, because you know snacks lunch snacks again um, and I need to clean this out look this is where Jackson was sitting so that I could actually get stuff done um, and then yeah so you're seeing a bunch of like trash right now but I want you guys to know that I'm not being wasteful this is not I will say actually 
I feel incredibly wasteful. Like I got really frustrated with myself looking at all the trash that I have, uh, food and just everything. So this is really giving me a wake up call to like what I actually need. I'm gonna be very, very intentional from here on out when I go grocery shopping, when I am cooking, when I am all of that, I'm gonna be super intentional from here on out. Um, I just don't want you guys to think that I I don't see everything that I'm tossing out. Like I, I see it. Um, and then now that I'm in the kitchen, whenever I clean this up, I'm going to be really intentional about things that I keep and things that I donate uh, because there are some things that I've realized like, okay, even after I decluttered the kitchen uh, a couple weeks back, there are things that I kept and that now I can take a step back and say, okay, I kept them just because I have an emotional attachment to them or whatever. Um, and now I can say, okay, did I actually use it from here between then? So if I didn't, I'm going to donate that stuff because... Pretty much every, everything in my kitchen right now, since I have already decluttered a couple weeks ago, is like in really good condition. Um, that's why I kept it. So now we're gonna see what I need to donate because I don't use. And that is the whole point in minimalizing, minimizing a bunch of stuff in your kitchen and your house. So that's what we're doing. I'm gonna do a quick cleanup. I'm not going to do the time lapse on the cleanup because that's just too much time lapses for you guys. And I'm just going to do a quick cleanup, like I said, on my kitchen, do some dishes and everything. And then we're going to get to declutter this kitchen. Okay, so this is like real life, guys. I had to put my hair up because it's hot. Um, but I also wanted to show this to you guys really quick before I got my dishes done, got my kitchen pretty much straightened up, and we're about to do some decluttering in the kitchen. But look at that. Oh. oh, it just smells so good. I'm going to open up the windows back up. Let's see. I just love the smell of rain. Can y'all smell that? Oh, okay. So from here on out, the video quality might be really wonky. Um, like the lighting might be kind of bad because it's raining outside so I don't have any natural light and I really like to film with natural light and I don't even know where my artificial light would be for my camera so I'm really sorry I hope you guys don't mind um but yeah let's just get going on the kitchen <laughs> my top cabinets done now I'm gonna work on my oh that was loud um my drawers so that's what we're doing right now
seven hours later, <laughs> we finished the kitchen. We did the top cabinets, the bottom cabinets, all the drawers. We did the fridge, the freezer, and the pantry. I did not do the outside freezer, honestly, because everything in there is pretty fresh. So there's really not anything in there that I should feel the need to declutter out of there. Um, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys around. Um, tomorrow I plan on doing, I think tomorrow I'm going to... I'm gonna do the bathrooms tomorrow, get that out of the way, and then I'm gonna do the kids' rooms, and then I'm gonna do my room, and then so on and so on. So, um, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys around. Okay, so I um, really just wanted to kind of talk about what we did. So basically, we went through the pantry, and we just decluttered everything in the pantry. Um, we took out expired food, stale food, um, um, old food that I just knew we weren't going to eat. Um, then I did, um, I went through the fridge and I obviously took out everything that was expired. I cleaned off the shelving. I, um, really just emptied it out to get ready for our new groceries for the week. Um, and then I went through all of our drawers and really just emptied out anything that I knew we weren't going to be using utensil wise plates like that. Um, plates that I knew we weren't going to be using, um, like chipped ones, um, extra silverware, extra, um, you know, gadgets and whatnot. Um, and then I went through my spices and kind of just really just, you know, combined any spices that I had multiples of, like I had multiple cilantros and I just added those together. Um, just kind of straightened that up. And then in my medicine drawer or medicine cabinet, I did the same thing. Um, just kind of situated that a little bit in my pots and pans drawer. That was pretty much already done. Like I said, I did this a couple weeks ago. Um, and then my bowls and baking ware, I really got rid of a bunch of stuff there. Um, and then Tupperware. I got rid of all my old miscellaneous Tupperware and I'm going to be donating that um, because I bought a new packet of Tupperware at Costco and that way that I can have a entire new set that matches and has lids to everything. Um, so I really, really like the all matching Tupperware. I feel very adult in that aspect. So um, then I kind of went off and cleaned off my countertops just, you know, straightened up anything um i put my i found oh i did do under my sink i did forget about that i cleaned up under my sink i've had those bins in there for a while and i just kind of made sure um to go through it i threw away old cleaners um and just kind of situated everything i went from i did my um like soaps with the um sponges and dusters and then I did let's see I did like my mopping stuff with the floor mop cloths is what I'm trying to say and then I did a bin of sprays paper towels and then I did a section of like bathroom cleaners toilet cleaners such like that um and that's pretty much really what we've got um I had a lot of fun doing this um it was it took a long time with the kids but hey we got it done um so i'm excited to see what we're able to get done tomorrow like i said i'm going to go ahead and continue with the bathrooms tomorrow so make sure you are subscribed and got your notification bell on so that we can do the bathrooms together um i hope you guys enjoyed i hope you find it's found inspiration um i am tired i'm going to go enjoy the rest of this rainy day with my family while I edit this and upload it for you guys. Um, it was a lot of fun and I'm excited to do it for tomorrow as well. I will see you guys literally tomorrow. So have a great night. Um, give it a big thumbs up. So I know that you guys like this content. Um, they're slamming doors back there. <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching. Um, comment down below if you enjoyed and let me know if you're cleaning at the same time that I am because I love to know that I'm not alone. So again, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow in my next video. Um, God bless. Bye guys.